the Chancellor's Medallion um, is such a, a unique and special award for this university and, and Judy represents uh, what I think are those values um, very well. She's, she's always um, reaching out in the community, uh, making her presence uh, felt uh, for the better of Southern Indiana. And she's done that throughout a long and, and distinguished career. I think Judy and IU Southeast complement each other, come together with this medallion in a perfect way. Both the institution of IU Southeast and, and she as a person are motivated by the same thing that this is a wonderful part of the world, and the people here are terrific. And a lot of them have not had opportunities to grow, and that given some help, they really can grow. And when they do that, the whole community flourishes. So she and Indiana University Southeast are a perfect match for this medallion award. The ways Judy has impacted this community has just been tremendous. When you look at everything from the Kentucky Derby Festival, her many, many years of involvement with that, with her membership here on the board at the Ogle Center, with her governor's appointment to the uh, Indiana uh, Arts Endowment, to uh, our Horseshoe Foundation board, I mean the list goes on and on. In fact, it's, you know, the Catholic litany of the saints is shorter than Judy's litany of involvement in our community. When Judy said she'd do something, she did it. And she did it with a happy disposition as though she appreciated an opportunity of being part of the program, part of the group. She never did it as, poor me, I'm a big martyr, feel sorry for me. Uh, I'm doing this and I make you feel guilty. She did it like this is a hopeful event. That's a rare uh, personality trait, and one that um, I personally benefited from. My whole family benefited from it, and I think the whole community and Southern Indiana has benefited from that. I believe Judy's biggest strength is her ability to really listen, to take it all in, synthesize it, and summarize it in a way that makes sense to people. She, she has that ability to um, connect with people and communicate with them in a way that, that is just unique to Judy and she makes you feel important and special in, in, in those communications. Oh my gosh, I could come up with a thousand reasons why she deserves the Medallion Award. Uh, but I think it's, it's been her co commitment, her, her service over the years in so many different ways. Like I said, whether it's kids or community or uh, in the metro area, whatever it is, Judy just gives 100% to whatever, whatever she does. Uh, she loves the arts. Uh, she's certainly given a lot to IUS um, with her leadership here. And uh, without a doubt, she is a very deserving leader. And I was so excited to see her name on the list. It is perfect, and I think why your award is perfect for Judy. What is a regional uh, educational institution all about? It's about mining those human resources that need a little encouragement, they need instruction, they need development, uh, because human resources are going to develop regionally into those economic strengths. Judy, congratulations on this well-deserved Chancellor's Medallion. Uh, you certainly deserve it for all that you've accomplished in your career. Uh, I, along with I'm sure many in this room, feel just so very fortunate to have gotten to know you, be around you, work with you, uh, and, and be with you over, over all that you've been able to touch and influence in Southern Indiana. Congratulations, Judy. Congratulations, Judy. This is one of the few times you've let us congratulate you. Most of the time, you've been busy lifting us up, and it is fitting that we now, along with Indiana University Southeast, say to you, girl, you did well. Congratulations, Judy, on receiving the IUS Chancellor's Medallion Award. Congratulations on a wonderful career, on giving so much to your community, and just being a fantastic lady.